Hey guys, it's Applash.com here, reviewing another awesome app. This one is called Tiny Wings, and it's second place right now in the App Store, followed by Angry Birds. The interesting part about this is they're both apps based on birds. So I've been calling this the Battle of the Birds. Right. So let's just take a look at this game real quick much simpler premise than angry birds is completely different in its style of gameplay but at the same time incredibly fun and addictive just like angry birds basically you gotta get this bird to go as far as he possibly can before the sun goes down as you can see in that bottom left hand corner the sun meter as the sun fades out and the moon comes in, as soon as the moon is completely taken over the meter, for some reason, this little bird has to go to sleep. Don't ask me why, I don't know, that's just the game. But, the point is, he can't really fly, his wings are tiny, hence the name, Tiny Wings. And you gotta skip him from island to island as fast as you possibly can, by running him up and down these curves with your finger. When you push down on the screen, he folds his wings in and he's more like a leg weight than a bird. So it takes some strategy. It's taken me a few hours of getting used to to get good at this game because it's a lot of timing and precision, which also gives it a similarity to Angry Birds. <laughs> But um, an incredibly fun and addictive game. Something I have not seen in the App Store in a long time. Since, you know, since probably Doodle Jump came out, have I seen a game as addicting that is not Angry Birds. Obviously, Angry Birds is more of a strategy type game. This is more of a platformer. So, that's basically the premise of the game. I find this... I find that I could play this game much longer than Angry Birds and still have fun. After a while at Angry Birds, I just get frustrated out of my mind because I can't finish levels. This, there's always something, you know, it, it, it's random chance how well you could do. It's not all determining by, you know, oh, you know, I, I can't hit this pig or I'm running, I don't have enough, you know. It's always random chance and it's just fun because you're always moving around and I don't know I just find this a much a game that you can play much longer than Angry Birds but yeah um I'm gonna try to finish this game up here for you guys to show you what happens when the sun goes down and how he just drops dead basically not he doesn't die he goes to sleep but that's basically what happens, he'll just be up in the air one minute and then he'll just die. Just like that. And you can see the Z's, he's not dead, but he's sleeping. So, that's the game. It integrates with um, Open Faint and also uh, Game Center, so whatever you like to use, um, it's there for you. But uh, not a whole lot more to it than that. There's no customization, I mean, you're pretty much stuck with that bird. I'm sure updates in the future are going to give us some more, but until then, this is basically what we got. So, that's Tiny Wings. I hope you liked this review. If you did, you can check out more at Applash.com. And if you liked it even more, you can subscribe to this channel for our latest reviews that I'm hoping to put out daily. So, anyways, I'm Colby with Applash.com, and we'll see you next time.